Hello Hello there. there. I'm Robert. And I'm Vanessa. We are late to the party on to episode three of The Penguin. Things are uh, popping off right now in the world of Gotham. We've got some infighting between the families orchestrated by Oswald Cobb himself. And I'm excited to see how it's all going to play out for him and everybody else involved. Yeah, because it feels like he's just digging himself deeper into a hole of lies everywhere. And it's like, how is he going? Like he said, you know, he's got to think on his feet for when things go wrong. So we'll see how it is because right now... Now, Sophie's like, hey, you and me, we got to partner up. But little does she know, he is the man that killed her brother. So it's going to be interesting to so see. I feel like Sophie does have her suspicions. But at the same time, there's bigger fish to fry. So she's kind of looking elsewhere besides Oswald. She did look at Oswald. But after he weaseled himself out of it a couple times, uh, yeah. He waddled out. <laughs> he sure did. And I feel like, you know, eventually... You know, she's going to set her sights back on him. But uh, we watched Joker Folly Adieu. We had a lot to say about it. You can check out our review on the channel right now. I'm sure plenty of you have a lot to say about it as well. But let's get into episode three of The Penguin now. Everyone's already on the roof. I, uh, I got to drop this off real quick. But I'm going to I'm gonna meet you up there. Really be paying you extra, you know, for... Finding special parts? Manny pays me well enough. Biggest right. He's taking advantage of you, Bucky. We have more than enough. Yeah, but getting what you're owed and what you're worth shouldn't just take it. Graciela's waiting for me. I gotta go. Invite her here. We have a lot of food. Yes. Hell yeah, free food. Invite me too. Is Calvin going to be there? Bye. You don't even know him. Not a part of Squid's crew. Chill out for once and let me see my friends? Fine. I mean, he has reason to be worried. You are in some deep shit. What up, Victor? I hate squid. What's he looking at him that way for? You should get some flowers. You know, like, like I got over in Memphis. I like that we get to see a little bit of his side, you yeah. know? She's wild. It's like anything could happen. A little bit of that penguin in him already. I know. <laughs> Maybe a little bit. Oh, damn. It's just starting. Oh, I thought it was like blowing up people. Oh, shit. Oh. It is. Oh, this is the oh. night that it happened. Oh, no. That makes oh, sense. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, shit. Yeah, because the whole area is supposed to be like effed up. Yeah. Oh, dang. I didn't even think of that. Me neither. That's right, because wasn't that one of his friends, the dude that got killed? Damn. Oh no! Oh no! Hopefully they got out okay. <laughs> That's devastating. Dude, they got me with that cold open, man. I didn't yeah. even think. I just thought he was back at home. Right. You getting your fire grease all over my window, kid? Are we uh, kind of partners now? Temporarily. Falcons will take care of it for us. Isn't Luca her cousin? Uncle. All these fucks are related, you know? <laughs> Two Sicilian brothers jizzed all over the toe of that boot. <laughs> now I got three dozen Falcons breathing down my neck. <laughs> they got around. <laughs> Tell them that's the bird and the bee story. <laughs> I mean, you fucked up, but you learned, right? It won't happen again. Yeah, and his, like, stutter is more prominent, too, just because of all the trauma, probably. Yeah. Just a guy to me. We never discuss your salary. There you go. Yeah, Pam. We start you on one a week, huh? One thousand a week? Hell yeah. How's anyone supposed to know your wife unless you tell them, huh? I want two thousand. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. But no. But no. <laughs> <laughs> Not yet. That's good. <laughs> Buy me some time. Hold on, Oz. What if, what if she asked me about her brother? Or Castillo? Just tell your hand and kill them both. See what happens. They can fuck them. Just use a pussy cat. Uh, obviously, yeah, don't. <sighs> no, take a deep breath and do it. Right now, yep. <laughs> Welcome. I mean, she's intimidating. She is intimidating. Without all the, you know, serial killing. Right. He's yeah, like, I've nice. been here before. <laughs> Tacky. <laughs> <laughs> but still cool. You're a mechanic. Um, yeah. Uh, 
Then why can't you work a lighter? She's gonna do it. You know, Oz used to be my driver. Did he tell you that? He ratted her out, probably. Just us. Sorry, Victor, it's gonna be a long night. Come on, you're driving. Like, just like old times. Oh, so, yeah, like the good old days. Still, that's kind of a F you. I think that's just her way of like, yeah, I'm working with you, but know your place. Know your place. With me. Victor? Hi. Where have you been? At least she's okay. And she sounded but eager. where is his family? I know. <laughs> I thought Alberto told you everything. Well, I wasn't exactly a detail-oriented guy, you know. Marco. He just told me he had big plans. Looks good, Miss Rockwell. They're funneling drugs out of Arkham? I thought this was all Al's plan. I know you did. Damn, <laughs> she was working on it. Yeah. She just wanted to bring her brother in. So that kind of like digs a little bit in the hole because then she's like, oh, really? He told you yeah. about it? When yeah, it's her it's thing. Hers. Yeah. Mushrooms? I mean, HBO is all about that mushrooms, right? Uh, the yeah. Last of Us. <laughs> it's not exactly what I call uh, revolutionary. Uh, you have a very limited imagination. What do these things do? The fact that they're also shrooms, it's like, do you got a different chemist up in here? They're the Basidio spores. Spores? What did you just say to me? You have anybody with the nickname Poison Ivy anywhere? <laughs> Find me a distributor and we'll paint the town red. Damn. Got put in some work. And if you're good at it, it'll pay off. Mm -hmm. Calvin's not with you, is he? He disappeared around the same time you did. Maybe he's the one that got... Yeah. You look good. I missed you. you no, know, he doesn't really stutter anymore with her. Mm -mm. I'm leaving, Victor. Oh, oh no. no. It's probably for her safety, though. Our families are dead. No. We got to take care of ourselves now. You, you could come with me. Just run away, honestly. It's, it's your best shot. He's like a gangster. Oh. And I've seen stuff. I don't know what he would do. Yeah. Damn, Damn. you're stuck. I mean, nothing good can come from working for a guy like that. He, he's on his way back, so you, you got to go. What? Here. Whoa, this. that. No, no, listen, you can get me a ticket. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm going to meet you at Gotham Station. Uh, That's not going to happen. No. When he tells you to go to Italy, you get on a fucking plane. All I see is a spoiled bride who got what she deserved. I appreciate this. But I ain't fucking leaving. I just need some time to get a few Two things. Days, then you go to Italy. Or I tell people that's where you went. <sighs> Damn, you get sleep with the fishes. Chinatown, huh? You're aware that my father pushed the triads out of the drug game? Yeah, I was there, dog. Peace offering. Hospitality gift. My pal Link Tsai. Triad deputy, he runs the clubs. Feng Zhao is the dialogue. That is the only person that can authorize a partnership. Well, we don't got a relationship with Feng Zhao, do we? You gotta start from the bottom and work your way up. I told you not to show your face yet till you have my money, Oz. Hey, come on, Link. We both know that if I ever truly left you hanging, there'll be a bulb between my eyes. This is why we're here. We're calling it Bliss. Good morning, Miss Bliss. There's this girl, and uh, you know I'm not a rat, right? No, you know no, 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 no. This ain't the good way to go about it. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me. Oh, shit. And you got all the drugs in the back, but technically they don't know it's drugs because they don't know it exists. Step out of the car, son. Uh, oh, shit. Is this your car? What are you... No, oh, he's dirty. It's a lot of money for a kid your age to be carrying around. He's gonna take a cut. I don't have any money. Pay him off. As soon as your boss is back, get out of here. <laughs> Vic! Oh, jeez. Oh. That was all his money. I, yeah, but you had to. You'll get more money. You know, we got support from within the family. Johnny VD. Johnny is my mother's cousin. He and I are very close. Tag team it. A phone call would suffice from Johnny VD. I'll have VD give the old man a ring. I dig that there music in the background. What aren't you telling me about Johnny VD? I got a plan. Blackmail him. He's gonna have to trust me. 
He took the whole fucking G. <laughs> well. <laughs> Motherfucker. That's of course a dope business kid. You know, welcome to life. Yeah. That he wants to go not be a part of anymore. <laughs> right. I'll do the uh, the, the steak. Uh, steak. Uh, steak freed. Hey. Don't do that. The man was speaking. Let him finish. There you go, Oz. Freeds. Steak freed steaks. Right away, sir. You got fight in you, Vic. You gotta let it out. Nice. By the time this is all over, Vic's gonna be like a completely different character. Probably. I can't wait for it. <laughs> My dad, he was a mechanic. Oh, okay. Yeah. Love to cook. Is that right? Yeah. <laughs> well, it's like mostly uh, carnitas and sancocho, <laughs> things like that. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Sounds delicious. I don't think he ever got to eat in a lot of nice restaurants. That ain't fucking right. The world ain't set up for the honest man to succeed. America's a hustle. Who's his name? Juan Ramon Aguilar. The one Ramon Aguilar. Well, God, I love Oswald so much. Like, he's horrible, but he's Adding a great mentor. To it, like, yeah. he, it seems like he cares. Right. And he probably does. But it's you know, it's that same thing when he talked about like that old school gangster that would the people you know, protect the people. Protect the people, yeah. Hi, Athena. Awesome. I need a favor. It's gonna sting. It's gonna go through her. Yep. <laughs> Maybe that's why they're there. Oh, set him up. Catch him in person. Fuck. Yeah, they're really gonna blackmail him. Don't forget your panties. <laughs> it's a hell of a dynamic duo. You're going against Luca to back a psychopath. You're gonna back her too, Vinny. <laughs> I don't think she appreciates you calling her a psycho. He's absolutely right, I don't. You are gonna get things out on the line, and the we ain't got your support. You get to fuck Tina's brains out on a beach with white sand somewhere. Yeah. Sounds pretty good. Done it? <laughs> <laughs> but people don't keep you around because they think you're smart. Don't kill him, Oz. People keep the penguin around as entertainment, and you're a goddamn joke. God, you oh, fuck. shit! No! Ah. Don't! Don't! Oh! You and the family hanging Sophia out to dry! <laughs> with my <laughs> phone! Yeah. <laughs> Broke it with your mouth. Make the fucking cool. Yeah, dude, and dude freaking threatened her, though. Like, he just threatened he sure to kill did. her. Yeah. So Oz just got her thrown in prison, I assume. Right. All right we're going to start at 20 a hit. No. Right. Vic here He's going to be our bag man for the All night. Right, get out there and make us a fuck ton of money. <laughs> Go on, do your thing. Nope. Not happening. Hey, kid, shoulders back. Take up space, okay? I believe in you, kid. <laughs> get him, champ. <laughs> We're gonna be untouchable. Love his white suit. Hmm. It's very penguin. Yes. You say all the right things, don't you, Moss? <laughs> Sings like a bird. I mean, penguin is a type of bird. That ain't what I'm saying. Zhao is here to see me, not my former driver. Gotta knock you down a couple pegs. <laughs> yeah, dude! Fucking like came for the low. All right, where's Zemo? Where's yeah, Zemo? Where's Baron where's Zemo? Zemo? <laughs> Completely different company, but yeah. still. Does the. Uh... Yeah. Where the boys at the table. Selling like hotcakes. There is no better feeling. Yeah. It's like Pop Rocks. It does look like that, huh? And that translates into dollars. Oh, Zemo. shit, dude. It's Shredder. <laughs> Their city has been decimated. The world as they knew it. It's gone. The show's starting. Oh, PTSD. Yep. Just for a moment. Oh, oh shit. Shit, shit, shit. I mean, seeing that is very traumatizing. <laughs> wow. That was beautifully shot. Shit's everywhere. Keep it together. Well, at least she's being nice about it. Yeah. You know, like... Helping. Helping him, yeah. That's why they gave it to us in Arkham. Any pain that we had just floated away, allowing us to forget where we were. Mm. And whoever controls it will control the future of the drug trade. 
Hell of a saleswoman. Right. But if you are not interested, it's fine. God, I just realized her dress. It's so fire. Make the deal or don't. I'll be downstairs. There he is. I try to answer it. God damn it. We're sweet. <laughs> you held your own tonight. I'm proud of you, Vic. Mm -hmm. Proud of you. <clears throat> Tell him. Be honest with him. You got to be honest with him. And you want to bail for what? A piece of ass? Oh, it's not her. Well, you're too good for this life. You want to go? What are you waiting for? Reverse psychology. You're right. Like you think I'm holding you hostage or something? Hey, hey. This is what it feels like. This is all you feel. Yeah, he didn't have a gun to your head. Until Tell now. Whatever you wanted. My dad would be ashamed of me. You want to know what's shameful, Vic? Working your whole goddamn life, having nothing to show for it. They don't give out awards for dying in the projects. Damn. Fuck you. Fuck me! Fuck the goddamn world! So go, get the fuck out of here. You don't decide this. Gave you the out. Yeah. He's gonna go back though. Well, we'll see, we'll see. <laughs> Put it on the... Oh! No, 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 no! What are you doing? God, the music's been firing this entire episode. They gotta give you that, like, club vibes. What are you gonna do? He knocks some sense into him. Oh, nice transition there. <laughs> Is it done? Triads are in. You should celebrate. I'm sure that you'll manage just fine without me. She's probably thinking that this should have been with her brother. Yeah. Jesus Christ, fine. I fucked you over. Tell me that's not your attempt at an apology. <laughs> <laughs> I swear I thought I was looking out for you. Bullshit. You ratted me out. I ain't no rat. And I'm not the hangman. And what was it all for? Hmm? You're not even a made man. Uh, yet. I still made out like a goddamn bandit. And you know what? I got the club, the drops operation to run my own thing. Guy like me. Dang. Getting all that meant I could have a better life. Oh. Colin Farrell. <laughs> I don't regret what I got. show is incredible. I love it so much. No, 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 but I'm sorry. That you had to be a part I'm of that. I'm fucking sorry for everything that's happened to you. You meant something to me. Still do. And I fucked it up. That I ain't never gonna live down. Oh, Tug did her heartstrings a little bit. Touch it by the heart. They were that close. Yeah. Like that's how she knew to how to work the lighter and everything. Yeah. I don't know where to go from here. To the top. I don't know how to trust you. Don't. Yeah. Don't trust him. <laughs> how about I keep showing you how? Whoa! 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 whoa. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, oh, no. You think he can pay us? Oh, no. Oh, is he going to is he gonna ram him up? I hope. <gasps> that would cause so many problems, though. Yeah. <laughs> what are you going to do? It's time to shine. <laughs> oh, he's going for it. Oh, oh no. Just one. That's not good. Ooh, he got busted up. Oh, go oh no, oh, fast escape. Fuck, leave her. Leave her? Oh, it's a mess again. I knew you come back. I fucking do it. Some fucking. We're in it now. Yeah, you are. Oh, Damn my it. God. And he left her there when they were having a good moment, and now that. That's out the window. <laughs> I mean, we we don't know what was said when he was, you know, at gunpoint. She didn't seem to be there, so maybe she it took off of too. No, she she after he like scrambled and jumped in the car. Uh, it didn't look like she was still there, so she probably ran too. Maybe or they got her. Like, damn, this episode <laughs> powerhouse across the board. Yeah, Vic. If, I was going to say it was like a Vic heavy episode, like his yes. episode, but it was very balanced with Vic and what's going on with Oz. True, but it was also like we needed all of that Vic stuff to kind of get to where yeah. he is now. And now we're like, oh, yeah. okay, now we're no, we know where he was at, 
like where what he's kind of going through, and then we can now like move forward type yeah. situation. Those conversations that they had in the bathroom, right? Uh, the, would, at the restaurant, like honestly, a lot of the stuff that that Oz says to Vic is a lot of the stuff that like he has to re- remind himself That's a true. lot of times because yeah. of the way that you know he is yeah. and it was almost kind of like when they were at the hotel and how you know he was telling him all this stuff and he got a super upset like he has to constantly tell him that to kind of keep going and he was too. gonna run too and his mom was the voice to right. kind of you know just yeah basically put the spurs to him to actually do the job. Yeah. Do what needs to be done. And right. Same thing with Vic. He just yeah. did it to Vic. But across the board, love this episode. The music choices, uh, just the, the way that they set us up with that first. And I'm sure plenty of you are already knew probably that this, this was a, a flashback at the beginning of the the episode it's possible, but, but <laughs> damn man like that caught me off guard then doing it again at the club and showing that he's got some ptsd about it which makes perfect sense with all the trauma that vic has been going through yeah. so quickly too when it comes to what's going down with oz uh i love sophia and oz's relationship there's so much there that we didn't even know about it, it just yo you were the driver but no they have a much deeper connection uh, just because they've been through the shit probably for quite some time. But yeah. I really liked it. I, I love this episode. I love this show. It makes me excited to find out what's going to go down with everybody. Mm-hmm. Uh, and, you know, it's it's great to have <laughs> a great villain in Gotham at the moment. <laughs> no, absolutely. One hundred percent. And then I love that, you know, we've got this new um, drug instead of a drop. How about a bliss? You know? Um, but it's interesting that you know they're derived from those mushrooms. So from it's Arkham? like, where are they getting the mushrooms from? Maybe it grows stuff like specifically that. there. Maybe who's at Arkham making the drug there? Yeah. Doctor Crane. You never know. Like I don't know. Poison I, Ivy. That'd be cool. Possibly. So yeah. that was one of the things that I was like, if they really wanted to bring poison ivy into this version of the batman like why not be a chemist why can't she be like a like a botanist and like yeah. herbs and like don't need to have the mystical por- part of it but uh, bring That's it true. down to earth because she's you know she could be a doctor pheromones and, then, yeah. and stuff and just yeah yeah it's very gas very, she can yeah. make the gas for the stuff yeah it's it's something that we are open to again like i love that it's focused on the penguin and this whole thing but uh, I do like, you know, little name drops here or there, but it doesn't have to be so on the nose, you know. No. Um, but I, I do like that they are living in the world of Gotham and it feels like we're living in the world yes. of Gotham, uh, which can't be said for other other. Other ones, at the it moment. just feels like you're in a city that you <laughs> sure, know, you know yeah. like Pittsburgh or Chicago. Sure. And that's, that's, that's what I love about the first Batman Begins movie because it, even though, yes, yeah, some of it does have the Chicago skyline and you can tell that, but there was still that grittiness that it felt like Gotham and you yeah. had the narrows that felt like Gotham. It did. And that's why like in Dark Knight, and that's no slight against Dark Knight, Dark Knight Rises, but Dark Knight feels very Chicago. I, yes, it was filmed in Chicago, but it just feels like Chicago not so much Gotham. Yeah. Uh, and then Dark Knight Rises, they were clever enough to where they used Pittsburgh, they used Chicago, they used New York, they used Los Angeles. So they kind of used everywhere to kind of mix <laughs> it up a little if bit. If you know those landmarks and stuff, you're like, oh, it, yeah, I know it, these places. It, you're, you know exactly where they are, you yeah. know, Wall Street. It's, it's very prominent in New York. Mm-hmm. But Gotham feels like Gotham, and I love it. The Penguin feels like Penguin, and this outfit and the style and just Colin Farrell. Colin that Farrell, when he man. was tearing up and that. talking to yeah. her, uh, like it's. It, I mean, he was probably tearing up. He's like, I don't want to uh, get me out of this suit. <laughs> I know, having to emote with all that makeup on you, and yeah. he's doing a hell of a job. They're all doing a hell of a job, hell of yeah. a job with this show. Mm-hmm. Uh, and I dig it, and I can't wait till next week. So it's something I'm looking forward to now. Um, when whenever it's Sunday, so. What did you think of this episode? Let us know in the comments below. You can also like and subscribe. And do the thing on our Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, Instagram, Discord. All the social networking gin joints, you know where they are. Kick into the party. Fuel the party. Keep the party going on our Patreon. Make sure you check out our review for Joker Folly Adu, available on our channel now. Thanks so much. And as always. Now it's time to say goodbye. And this party is over. Bye. Bye.